The state's largest teachers association says no to a budget proposed in the House of Representatives that does not include a teacher pay raise. Fox 4's Sean Rabb live with that. Sean. Clarice, uh, good evening to you. Listen, the American Federation of Teachers, uh, AFT, they wanted a $10,000 pay raise per teacher across the board, raises for support staff and more. What's coming out of the House of Representatives in the House proposed budget has no real pay raise for teachers, no big pay raise. And it's getting pushback, opposition from the teachers union. Districts big and small are challenged to find teachers for their students. We don't have a lack of teachers. We have a lack of people that are tired of being disrespected and are choosing not to go back to the classroom. This week, the House of Representatives scheduled to vote on its proposed budget that does not include a pay raise for teachers, other than what's tied to an increase in dollars allotted to student learning. The House proposal sets that at a $50 increase per student. At $50 per student, that would only be about $455 for each teacher. There are two bills filed by state reps that call for increasing teacher pay by ten dollars or $15,000 per teacher and includes pay raises for support staff, but they've not been set for a hearing. Those are the only ones right now that we're aware of that address part of the problem for the lack of teachers being in our schools. Those bills uh, are offered by Democrats in a majority Republican legislature. The Senate Education Committee says all the state can do is a $2,000 increase for all teachers and 4000 for those currently making below the state average. I think they will get a raise this year because they haven't had one since uh, since 2019, uh, but uh, it's certainly not going to be at the upper end of the scale that Democrats are looking at, much more likely down where the Republicans uh, are talking about in the few thousand dollar range. The state does have a $32.7 billion surplus. Teachers say public school needs to get its fair share. I do think that in this session, because of the extra money, both teachers and schools will get increases, but we can't tell how much of an increase at this point, because that's fought out a month from now. Our lawmakers have to pay attention to what they're hearing from the actual people doing the work. So this Thursday, the House of Representatives will debate HB1, the House budget, on the floor. Wednesday evening, in advance of that, uh, the AFT holding a statewide meeting for educators and allies through Facebook Live.